All right, guys, I'm going to make you a little video to get you pumped up for hunting camp. So I'll give you an overview of the camp. Introduce myself. What's up, guys? Oh, <laughs> it's early. I'm Kev. Looking forward to having you guys, and uh, we'll give you a couple videos to get you pumped up for camp. So this is my house. We're right on kind of a busy road, but it's kind of in the world, not of the world. Um, this is super nice back here. Here's the Dead Sled 2.0. We'll use that some. Forgive me, I'm a tech idiot, but I know how to kill stuff, so the video is going to be not so great, probably. This is where we hang them. Yeah, I talk about redneck, right? Hang them from the swing set. We got a chain pulley here, makes hanging them easy. Here's, here's deer camp right here. A little camper's got electric and a beer fridge and... I figure we can use that pretty well through most of October. We got a nice fire pit over here. There's the house. And uh, so this field back here, it's about 75 acres. And we're going to take you through it on the quad in a little bit. This 75 acres back there used to be... Um, to be a tree farm they got tree farms all over here and rows and rows of small trees but this one got overgrown and they uh don't do much with it but they hate deer because they rub on the trees so they want me to kill as many as i can so it's basically if you think a tractor mowing a field right and big rectangles of trees that got overgrown so all the way from far left goes even behind this property next door which is like a public auction kind of thing a state antique thing but goes all the way from the left hand side long field that goes down starts sloping down and then there's uh woods down the far end with a creek that runs through the woods and we've got um one two three four we got five stands out there and a feeder um and there's some more stands we share we share with some other guys in the woods, but hardly anybody else hunts back here. So, um, yeah, looking forward to it, guys. Uh, pretty pumped to have you in, and um, should be a good time. And hopefully, we bag at least one, and we'll uh, we'll hang it from we'll hang it from here, and then we'll we'll take it all the way down to Bone right there and pack it up and pack it up into the freezer. Uh, we'll do everything here at the house. So um, it's been. A huge blessing for me to have this property and uh, and to get permission back here to hunt from these folks and um, and then just to learn over the years with you know from Grant Woods uh, Growing Deer TV if you don't know him check him out um, definitely we'll be doing archery hunting so to watch some Grant Woods um, really cool guy Christian guy and um, and you know watch his video on uh, see if you can find his video on butchering deer um, that's how I learned and it's really cool. And then just a lot of archery hunting techniques. Um, you you can learn a ton from him. I didn't know anything about archery hunting when I started here. I had only gun hunted with my dad growing up. Um, and crossbow is a great way to start. It's super easy. It's a really close in experience. And I mean, we've probably taken, we've taken 20 deer off this property at least in the past five years. So, um, if we have a few guys and we make a good go at it for two, three days, <clears throat> we have strong odds of bringing something in. So God bless you guys. I uh, can't wait to meet you and uh, see you, Seth. And um, yeah, should be a great time.